Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Safina Chaynock. We will soon learn more about this week's double murder in downtown Covington. The St. Tammany Parish Coroner says he will hold a joint news conference with the Covington Police Department this afternoon in Lacombe. Here's what we know from the investigation so far. Early Monday morning, two bodies were found badly burned on East Gibson Street. Now, one of the victims has been identified as retired priest Father Otis Young from St. Peter Catholic Church. The coroner says the preliminary cause of death for Father Young is blunt and sharp force trauma, meaning he was beaten and also stabbed to death. Covington police have now arrested Antonio Tyson and booked him on first degree murder and second degree kidnapping charges. Now, in a statement this morning, the coroner confirms that the second victim is in fact a woman and that her identity will be released at a press conference set for today at 1 p.m. Now, meanwhile, right now, a memorial for Father Otis Young is growing outside St. Peter Catholic Church with flowers and also notes. Parishioners are remembering Father Young for all the good he did while he was alive, and they say they're still coming to grips with their loss. Angry, frustrated, I think it's wrong. He didn't um, deserve this, and he was a wonderful, wonderful um, priest, and he, he always was there for everybody. Funeral services for Father Otis are set for Monday at the church. Visitation starts at 9 a.m., followed by a funeral mass at noon. And we are 